Hey there, everyone. How are you doing today? So I would like to share with you a transaction that we completed here recently. We actually secured the initial lead well over a year ago, but working with the seller who needed our help, working with the property that really needed our help, as you will see in a minute, uh, we were able to really help all sides of this transaction. And Hopefully what you will see in this presentation is if you need to sell a property in Fresno, California, the Central Valley, we, I am here to help you. Uh, if you need a cash buyer, if you wanna sell with owner financing, if you are in a tough spot uh, in this recent environment and you would like to look at maybe subject to where we take over your mortgage payments, we are here to help. And I would like to share this example with you. Uh, it should take 15 or 20 minutes, plenty of before and afters. Just to, again, let you know a little bit about me, a little bit about the office that we have created in Fresno, California, because I believe there's a lot of people who need to sell real estate and can't do it because of condition of the property, of their finances, of other situations. So, if you need to sell your property in Fresno fast, I want to hear from you. And you will see on the last slide. So if you want, you can scroll forward. Uh, you'll see my email. You'll see a phone number for somebody on the team. Because again, the thing that I like to do most is talk to sellers, really understand what is going on, and see if we can help. You know, sometimes in this environment, we help list properties if that's the right answer. Uh, but for many folks, they need what we have, the ability to buy cash. Maybe they're a frustrated landlord. They've depreciated the property to zero, and they need somebody they trust that will, will take over and give them seller financing. We are a great option for that. I have 100 now, probably 50 units that are seller financed that we do that for. So again, we're going to be in the business a long time. We have a building, which you will see here momentarily dedicated to real estate and helping people. So let's get into the presentation and uh, we will see what we have. So let me share my screen. So in this particular uh, example, we will just call the property 4th Street. That's the, the street it's on. We're just gonna reference it as 4th Street. We're gonna have plenty of before and afters. We're gonna talk about the money that's made. We're gonna talk about the seller. Uh, but in the end, there's an owner of a property in Fresno, California that needed to sell. This particular example was probate. Uh, that she inherited, didn't have the money to proceed. She was in desperate situations. The, the property was horrible uh, and she needed help. And we helped her uh, immensely, uh, both in time and expenses and making sure she walked away with cold, hard cash. Uh, you know, maybe you're a frustrated landlord and you want help and you want out now. Let's talk. I'll, I'll move as fast as possible. Just need a clean title and we can go. Seller financing is a great option. If you're an owner who unfortunately lost their job and you want to do subject two to get away from your debt, uh, let's talk. I think there's lots of ways we can help. First and foremost, um, I want you to know that we have an office building in Fresno. There's the, the building there on the left. It's there on Van Ness. It's in the Tower District, 9328. 93728 right near Fresno City College. I bought that building vacant. I spent almost 50 grand repairing it because I wanted to have an office full of real estate professionals that are here to help. We have cash buyers, licensed agents, licensed contractors, wholesalers, flippers, all kinds of resources there. In fact, I have two offices vacant. If you want to be a part of this moving and shaking real estate office, come on in. Remember, nobody works for me. Everybody is their own small independent company. I'm not a broker. I'll never be a broker. None of these people work for me. I will never have employees. I am in focused on helping people. That's what I'm about for the next 50 years. And this office is there for you. So here's the backstory of the deal. Uh, the property actually came via one of the wholesalers at the hub, right? This building, the hub, we have two or three wholesalers there. So they contacted the owner of this property, which we'll, you'll see in a minute via a cold call uh, back in 2019. 
Uh, this property is a probate, meaning the owner passed away. It went to his daughter, his only daughter. Unfortunately, the probate process costs money, which the daughter did not have. And, oh, by the way, the building was being destroyed by squatters that moved in when her father uh, owned it and was not in a position to fight or get them out. Uh, we, again, via communications, we learned that his daughter didn't have any money. She couldn't afford the five to eight grand in probate fees. The property was being beaten every day by squatters, just more and more people tearing it apart. Uh, the daughter needed money. She needed cash. Not only for probate fees, but just for life. She was in bad spot. So we were there to help. So the property ended up closing um, our transaction in October, but we closed hers in early 2020 during this health event. She was a, we covered, we covered her, I think it was almost eight grand in attorney fees. Uh, and she walked away with over $5,000 in cash. We covered everything else. And we took on the liability of dealing with squatters when we picked it up. So we did, we, we bent over backwards for her to make sure she was taken care of, make sure she could move on, make sure uh, she was really treated quite well through this process because it could have gone really, really bad. So in the end, as we do on all our properties, after getting rid of the squatters, we remodeled everything, kitchens, bath, floors, paints, appliances, new HVAC, you know, garage doors, everything. So here's the before of the front. After we put on our standard two-tone paint, you can see the garage on the left. You really can't see the original here, but the roof was trashed. We put on a brand new roof and an, uh, a new garage door. Uh, here's the kitchen before. Again, it was squatters, right? You can see there was no running water. They had those water jugs. It was, uh, it was bad. It was, it was bad. It was disgusting. It was getting worse every day. This is what we turned it into. Brand new cabinets, backsplashes, uh, granite. Got a little fancy with the uh, backsplash there. New flooring, new trim, paint, faucets, electrical switches, everything. Bathroom, disgusting, as you would imagine in a house full of squatters. Disgusting, 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 disgusting. Not anymore. Beautiful tile. We had some extra tile from the kitchen, so we threw that in the little soap dish. Again, we did this the right way, and that's tile in the bathrooms, both on the floor and in the shower. Bedrooms, really disgusting. Again, just yuck. You can see a little window AC there. Again, we do the right thing. Here's what the bad bedrooms look like after. This is the master. There was a big walkout, I think, there. Again, disgusting. After we did the, uh, we actually put in two different uh, he, uh, dual packs, what they're called, heating and cooling. You see one of them there in the upper right. New windows there, you can see the new window sticker still on it. New glass slider out to the backyard. There's the backyard, better picture of the garage. That's the garage there on the left. Just trash everywhere, just yuck. There we go, really cleaned up the garage. We actually changed the carport. Oh, you can't see the carport. We tore down the old metal carport, put on a new one. Again, don't always do the right thing. So in the end, if you are an owner of a property in Fresno and you need to sell fast, you want to sell for cash, you're a frustrated landlord. Landlords are getting smoked in this environment. I, I, it's just rough. Maybe you've been a landlord for a long time and you want out. Reach out to me via email. Maybe we can do a seller financing deal where you still get money every month. You save on taxes, year one taxes. Uh, there's my email. If you want to talk to somebody at the hub, Maybe you're interested in joining the hub. Maybe you just want to come check it out. You can call Adam. There's his phone number there, 
360-9622. And just because some of you may be listening to this in the podcast, my email is michael.p.j.zuber at gmail.com. Again, um, very proud of what we do at the hub. Again, I bought that office building. I converted, I turned that office building around because I want it to be the spot for real estate professionals. I have two offices open. If you are a mover and shaker in Fresno and you want to join others, let's talk about joining the hub. If you are an owner of property in Fresno, California, and you want to sell quick for cash, bad condition, you want to sell owner financing, maybe you're an owner of a brand new home, but lost your job and you want out. Maybe there's some subject to financing we could do. In the end, call Adam, email me, let us see if we can help. Again, we want to be in Fresno for the next 50 years and we want to help everyone we can. All right, everybody. Actually, you know what? We didn't talk about the deal. I made some money on that deal. Why isn't that there? Hold on. Let me go back. Huh. Eh, it doesn't matter. Ah, oh, man, let's share. I'm sorry. We didn't show the numbers. I don't know why that didn't come up. Here are the numbers. Why isn't that sharing? That's weird. All right, well, let's do it this way. I don't know why it's not sharing in slideshow. Something's not set up right. But here are the number breakdown. I apologize for breaking this up, but hey, that's what you do. What happens when it live? We bought it for 105,000. That includes the 8,000 in attorney fees, which we just included in the purchase price. Renovations were just over 40,000, rounded to 40. Uh, we do have cost of money, right? Carrying cost, cost of money, six grand. Uh, fees and commission, because there will be real estate agents and taxes and all these other things as a part of this selling it. We ended up selling it for 201. So the profit on this deal will be roughly $34,000. Again, that's turning a bad situation around. That's turning the neighborhood around. That's helping an owner occupant buy their first FHA home. There's just so much goodness when you talk to people, when you do the right thing. That's a big part of the hub. I want to have the best and brightest at the hub. I want to help more and more people. Uh, and I know in this environment we can. So uh, sorry about that little mix up, but there are the numbers. So at the end of the day, uh, you can do do you can do good and make money. Uh, we really helped the original owner out of a bad situation that really could have gone way worse. She was very happy. She walked away with significant amount of money for her. We were able to deal with the headache of squatters. We were able to invest the capital to turn it around. We saved that corner house for that neighborhood. And now we have an FHA buyer getting their first owner occupied home. It's a win, win, win all the way around. If you want to be a part of the hub, you want to come check out the hub, call Adam. Let's do this thing together and let's keep helping people. Thanks.